No, even though it would probably be smarter because it also has fighting packs, I will not. I instead will body slam. And it's gonna high kick me. Nope. Would have been a smart thing to do, but it might not have it. Although I'm pretty sure it has some kind of fighting attack. No matter. It's squashed. Aha. Just who was I cheering for? I don't know. Some lame team. It's about to go down. I'm gonna check in here before I go up, down, around, or something. Hey, it's the other two scientists. Huh? 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 I've seen this kid somewhere before. So who is he? I have no idea. But obviously he's not in Team Flare. Let's get him, yeah? Get that sounds good to me. Then I'll get in the first blow. Afraid not. Oh, okay, so we're going one at a time, fight you and then fight her. I thought it would be interesting to do a 2v1. We could just throw out two of my Pokemon versus one of the each of theirs. But, uh, we can do it this way, it's fine. Power Punch. Well, that's an interesting move. Take this. Crunch. Nom 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 nom. Hey, tank's now 55. Wood hammer. Grass type, physical on a 20. Uh, yeah, maybe if he had a hard head, but he doesn't. So, no. Sorry, I'm not a big fan of recoil moves. And Tyrantrum is 55. Drapion, Drapion, Drapion. Uh, screw it. We'll have Blaziken take him out. Actually, I should have thrown out, um... Oh crap, I should have Mega Ball too. But I should have thrown out Tyrantrum instead. Posing Drape on the is real sharply. That's fine. Time for you to Mega Evolve. Then Blaze Click. Keep saying Blaze Click. Blaze Kick. Blaze Kick. Blaze Kick. <laughs> Boom. <laughs> you beat us good. Wow, we are so lame. Glad you're just figuring that out. You know what? It's, it's a good thing to admit it, and then you can work on it. Oh, what a brute. Look at poor Slosia. Probably butchered that name too. I'm off old names. Well, let's see what you got. You can get power punched to oblivion. Ah, would you smack me in the face like that for? Good, taunt me. You're only gonna regret that later. Oh no, Sucker Punch. Oh, that next body slam is gonna hurt. Of course it went to six, uh, 57. Galvin's finally 53, still playing catch up. Uh, Bisharp. Ah. 
Can't really use body slam against him. Steel type it wouldn't really do much. Screw it for the lulls. Just want to see how much damage it'll do. Wow. Okay, it was a critical hit. That's why. Either way, we finish off with the body slam. Aha. Yay! Your abilities flies in the face of all probability. Just what is the source of your power? Determination and tenacity. Which are more or less the same. What's this? Who could have thought a child like you could beat us both? For God's sakes, I'm not a child. You and your Pokemon were utterly in sync in that battle, and I know why. You're here for the answers, aren't you? I suppose we're at your mercy. I'll tell you what I know, at least. We've been using the electricity we stole from the power plant to get prepared for activating the ultimate weapon. But it's not like that's all we need to use it. Are you following me? We need energy absorbed from Pokemon power uh, to power the device. Yes, it's the stone on Route 10 that will steal that energy for us and power the ultimate weapon. In reality, those stones that lie in Route 10 are the graves of Pokemon. When the ultimate weapon was used to end the horrible war over 3,000 years ago, it stole the lives of all those Pokemon. Their lives were the price of peace then. And if we want to make our own wishes come true today, we and Team Flare also have to sacrifice something precious. That's kind of twisted and messed up. You guys are wrong for that. Okay, yeah, that's fine. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Give me the key. Give me the key. It's fine. Can this stone really be used to absorb a Pokemon's energy? Do a little tap a tap here. Change some, you know, different paths here. Done. Sabotage your plan, sabotage your plan. It's weird, none of those scientists seem to have the key card I need. Oh well. Uh, where does this take me? Hey, there it goes. To a hyper potion. Certainly could use one of those. Go ahead and use it on Auntie. Now where to? No, really, I understand. It's only natural to be jealous of suit as stylin' as me. Please. Have you seen my outfit? You're just mad because I'm styling on you. And because my Snorlax is body slamming on you. Rock Tomb. Now 56 too. Win or lose, style is all. In a suit like this, I've got standards to live up to. I uh, hate to break it to you, but you're not very stylish. I don't think there's ever a time where a full red suit was ever in style. Haha, <laughs> it sure does feel good to let loose every once in a while. Spying on people's holocaster conversations gets boring really quickly after all. Oh my god, they were for the NSA! Or they are the NSA. Either way's bad. Give 
Give you some Hawaiian punch. Ew. I just want to raise my attack. Oh, screw it. Rock tomb. Get your speed fell. Put my attacks higher. I have no more body slams, unfortunately. Gotta use some Mether. Well, for all those moves that aren't being very effective, apparently they're effective enough to still kick his ass. No, I will not switch out. Power up punch. Done. Nice! My Pokemon like to let loose every once in a while, too. Yeah, give me your money. <laughs> you can let loose your wallet. Pay me because you lost. Let me go bag. a full restore on anti. Kinda needs it right now. Get through this door. There's another scientist. Oh 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 you're that kid from Frost Cavern. On your lonesome this time? Yep, I don't need anybody else. Ooh, that's cold. Colder than that cavern. Your Pokemon don't even count for anything. We gather data about all the trainers in the region through the Holocaster. So we know all about you guys. Well, you know what? That's not fair. I thought you were talking about just like me as a person, not with my friends. Didn't know you were talking about Pokemon. It's messed up. I know how the Mega Ring is used to awaken Pokemon's power, right? Just like how the ultimate weapon can max out a Pokemon's power. <laughs> Looks like you and me are practically after the same thing, yeah? Um, no. I'm not looking to wipe out the entire world except for myself and do it my own image. Damn it, Mabel. What are you doing out of Gravity Falls? I'm joining Team Flare. Team Flare's not cute. I thought that was your goal, was to be like cute. No matter. No, nope. each foul play all you want. Actually, the foul play kind of hits a little hard. Not gonna lie. Let's see what next. Do you have Weevil? Weevil, Weevil, Weevil. Go oh, Blaziken. Going for an Ice Dark? Well, I'm going for Fire Fighting, so you're just really screwed. You can exert all the pressure in the world. It's not going to stop you from getting this ass whoop. That's fine. Take this! Yes, towards 56 now. Go back to working for Grunkle Stan. <laughs> oh, you are strong. You and your Pokemon are most certainly not ordinary. You're damn right. Ding, ding, ding. Yep, you did it. To the victor goes the spoils. Here, an elevator key for you. Yay! 
The power of legendary Pokemon, the power to steal life from all around it. It's a mysterious ability that even scientists like us haven't been able to really decode. What do you think will happen in the world if we defeat an ultimate weapon with something like that? Nothing good, I'm sure. Uh, let's go this way. Yeah, I love going around circles. So I'm doing it again. Actually, that time wasn't intentional. Crap. To the elevator. Which floor would I like to go to? Well, it looks like basement two is the only option, so I think we're going to basement two. And in the meantime, another full restore for Andy. I'm actually glad that he's getting smacked around a bit. Getting a little tired of him being so awesome. He need a challenge. Listen. One who will face Lysander, Sandre, whatever. That dude is really tall. <sighs> Touching story. A terribly long time ago. There was a man in a Pokemon. He loved that Pokemon very much. A war began. The man's beloved Pokemon took part in that war. Several years passed. He was given a tiny box. The man wanted to bring the Pokemon back, no matter what it took. The man built a machine to give it life. He brought his beloved Pokemon back. The man had suffered too much, his rage still had not subsided. He could not forgive the world that had hurt Pokemon that he loved. That's some deep crap. He turned the machine into the ultimate weapon. The man became a bringer of destruction that ended the war. The Pokemon that was given life must have known. That the lives of many Pokemon were taken to restore its life. The resurrected Pokemon left the man. Give the key back. It should not be used. Everything will vanish again. Do you want to know the unending pain, like I have? 
That is AZ. He has the same name as the king that lived 3,000 years ago. And for some unknown reason, he had the key to the ultimate weapon hung around his neck. It's finally time. Follow me to my chambers. Uh, sure. Just let me take care of something here real quick. Crap, can't for him. I'm sorry, big dude. I'll see what I can do to stop him. Alright, where'd you go now? Basement 4 3, I guess. See where he ran off to. It's crazy glove guy. So the Pokeballs we received and the Pokemon we've gathered are where they need to be. Add it all up and it means all preparations are complete. The only thing left to do is to put the plan in motion. I'm counting on you. One push of a button and we can activate the ultimate weapon from this room. I believe being a chosen one means you have the potential to change the future. Whether we activate the ultimate weapon or leave it safely underground will rest upon if you actually have this potential or not. Well, of course I do. I am the chosen one! Oh ho ho. You're the one I've heard so much about. I've been waiting for you. I need to do a little research on you. Come, let us begin. He's so cool, he only wears one glove on his hand. Take some of these rocks. And you're slower, so you're probably gonna take the rocks first again. Nope. I should have actually remembered you're actually supposed to be really fast. But now you're dead. Oh yeah, Blizzkin's 58. Oh my god, things won't stop leveling. Melamar. You. It's your psychic dark. Body slam. Oh crap. That's not gonna end well. I do need to switch you out for once. Go with a uh, firefighting. Get Blaziken out here. Mega Evil Power Punch. Against the dynamic duo. 